Okay, for this video I'll be using the TCL Roku TV. The remote that comes with it is pretty similar to the one uh, to the remotes that come with the other uh, Roku devices. And basically, basically what I'll be doing today is uh, showing how to uh, restart a movie that is uh, listed as uh, on demand. Show how to get more information about a particular movie that's uh, playing. Add or remove a movie to the watch list, which is the same thing as the uh, library. And this again is my bedroom TV. Uh, I have no uh, cable connection here. This is uh, basically internet. So Netflix, YouTube, and all the other channels that I have ever apps, I, I watch using the internet. I have the Spectrum app. So the information I'm gonna talk about today is about uh, the spectrum map, so let me click on that. And I might blur out some uh, some part of the video just so I don't get cited for uh, copy uh, right infringement claims. Okay. So if I get, if I hit the uh, on the navigation on the uh, navigation button on the remote. You can see there, I have it on uh, Fast 5, and on the far right of that, you can see the uh, backward arrow, the U with the arrow on it. That, that indicates it's uh, on demand, so you can restart it. Okay, so if you go back over here, and you can see there, sometimes this doesn't show at the lower left. So if you hit the, uh, on the navigation, hit the uh, down button. Let me mute this. Hit the down button, and there you have it. it has restart. So then you just press the OK on this. Press OK. And it'll restart the movie. And you watch it. If you change channels, it goes back to where it was. So let me just hit the back button. And it takes it back to the original movie. Now, if I want some more information, notice on the on the uh, left over here, you just get pretty much the title and the time slot for that particular movie. But if I go down, down arrow, you have more options. So there, see, you see more information. Here's your description of what this uh, movie is. You can see it there on the screen. So obviously the movie is on right now, but it's on demand. So if you want to, if you want to add it to your uh, your watch list and watch it anytime you want, as long as it's available. Keep in mind that sometimes the these movies will be available for a month or two, and then you know. They take them off and other movies come in. So notice if you want to add it to your watch list, which is the same thing as library, we go over here. You can have a trailer there. Obviously, you can watch if you want to watch it now. Go over here. See, add to watch list. So if I hit the OK button, now it's on the watch list. Okay, so if I go, let me hit the back button. And then if I hit the back button again, I get to this screen right here. Obviously, if I want to just watch whatever's on right now, I just uh, click right there on Live TV. It's already on there. Just click the OK button. I can go to the guide. Okay. Let's scroll through that to see what else is on, what is on the other channels. Uh, also, at this particular point, you can add stuff to the uh, to a favorites list, which is different than your watch list or uh, library. I've got, I've got a video on that, so I won't go over that right now. Let me hit the back button. Okay. And now let me show you the library here. If I pick on library, okay. these are the ones that I've added to my 
library, also called the watch list, and there's the movie Fast Five that I just added in during this video. Okay. If you want to remove the movie from the watch list, then for example, let's make, let me take this out fast fast five. I'm gonna hit the OK button here on the remote. And then come down over here. And it was over here. Gives you more information about the movie there. If I go to the, it's on watch. If I go over here to watch list, okay, right now it's on the watch list. So if I click OK, it's removed. Notice right there it has a plus sign. So if you want to add it back, then you go ahead and click on it, and it'll add it back to the uh, to the watch list or the uh, library. And then you click the uh, back button again. And on the far left of the remote. And click it again and get to this screen here. Uh, now, uh, if you want to find a movie that's on demand, then here you have the option to go on demand. Or you could go ahead and just do a search here. You can search for a particular movie and you can see whether it's on demand and you can either watch it then or save it to your, uh, to your library. Okay, but if I go to On Demand, say I don't want to do a search, I just want to scroll through the list. I go to On Demand here, and then you have what's featured, and you can click on some of those, and either watch them or put them on your uh, library. Okay, now if you want to search by network on the top there, go over here to networks and you can scroll through all the channels. And of course, uh, that's assuming you have a subscription to, uh, to Spectrum, you know. So what you're able to access on demand depends on what your package, what movie package you have, what sports package you have and, and so forth. But here, here you can scroll through and uh, watch a movie or put it on your watch list. So again, uh, keep, keep in mind, I uh, uh, do some of these videos, occasionally they, they, they change the format as to uh, how you watch things or how, how you add things to your watch list. But anyway, that up to right now, uh, on this particular date, on, on the, uh, as, I, as I do this video, this is, what, uh, this is what we have. So I hope that helps you out and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching and stay safe.